Debbie Silver, hope you're doing well. So I get this a lot, uh, and maybe this is something you're going through. I don't have any energy, I don't have any drive. What's going on with that? You know what? A lot of times you don't have any energy, you don't have any drive, because you're bored. And you're bored because you're not challenging yourself. And you're not challenging yourself because everything you're doing is completely habitual. You know, think about it. From the minute you wake up to the minute you go to bed, your life is pretty much could, could kind of be the same day that you had the day before, the same day that you had before, the day, the same as the day, you know, the, the day before that. That's not really challenging. We thrive when we're challenged. That's how we grow. And it may be that you're lacking energy and lacking motivation, lacking enthusiasm because you really haven't challenged yourself. I mean, I'm not saying go be reckless and do something crazy, but when you challenge yourself in some way, you grow and it wakes the brain up. It makes you think differently. So take a look at your day. Are you completely on autopilot? And if so, number one, you're not growing. And number two, really good reason why you're bored. I totally get it. What can you do? Like I know with me, I was headed for a completely different direction. And um, as a result of a major life crisis, I wrote the book, The Unshakable Woman, The Unshakable Woman, The Workbook. I'm now in a PhD program for transpersonal psychology. I mean, I'm learning and growing every single day. And what are you doing? Are you, are you challenging yourself? Are you learning another language? Are you taking a chance at work? Are you uh, doing something with relationships, bringing yourself to the next level? What is it that you can do that challenges yourself, just brings you right outside your comfort zone? You know, I find with so many of us, we'll meet up with our comfort zone and then it starts getting really scary, so we retreat. But you know something? Life begins right outside your comfort zone. So what can you do to, to push yourself a little bit more? And you know it's going to be a push when it feels a little, you know that, that feeling where it's a little bit scary but exciting? I'm not talking about terrifying. I'm talking about scary but exciting. Think about it. Every single time you felt that and you did it, you felt great, right? Like remember when you jumped into the pool when you were a little kid? You were terrified and you kept wavering and then something happened. And finally, you were ready. And think about it. Whoever took you to the pool couldn't bring you home because you found bliss right past your comfort zone. And and think about also, that's how confidence is built. You know, we, we don't become confident by meeting up with the challenge and retreating. We become confident because we see the challenge, we take it on, and we thrive. Now, I'm not saying the challenge is going to be easy, but it's in that challenge, in that pain, in that struggle, there's the growth. There's the growth. So what's going on for you in your life that has become stagnant, that has become so familiar that you don't have to try, that you don't have to think, you know? And then what happens is you may, be, you may become a little bit bored, but you don't want to look at it. So then we find our ways to numb and distract ourselves through food, work, uh, drugs, alcohol, TV, keeping busy. Right? Because if we take a look at it, we're going to have to do something about it. Take a look at your life. See what's going on there. What can you implement that's a little bit different, that just wakes the brain up a little bit? Is there a trip you can take? Is there a language you can learn? Is there a book you can read? What, what's it going to be for you that, that wakes you up enough so you, you, know, so, so you just you realize, hey, life is, life is not meant for just doing the same thing over and over again and we just get older? Right? There are so many things that you're capable of doing and it's about, you know, we're either growing or dying. Are you growing? Are you doing things to grow every day? You'll find when you do, it gives you energy. When you're bored, it takes away energy. So uh, find something to do that gives you energy. I'd love to hear about it to see what this inspired in you. Please share this with your friends and family. Uh, check out my YouTube channel. And if something I said inspired you in some way and you want to talk about it, or if there's a way, you know, if and how I can help you, I'd love to know. Um, you just need to text the word schedule to 38470, 38470. Text the word schedule. That's actually going to get you on my calendar. And then we'll talk, see if and how I can help you. Thanks so much. Talk to you soon. Bye-bye.